Hey, my people, did you see what happened there? Did you see the angel? Please like, share, hit the notification button, and please leave comments. I really want to know what you think about this video. And please subscribe. Thank you very much for subscribing. God bless. Love you. Hello everyone, this is Emma from Tema. How are you all doing? I know the Lord himself is keeping us. And thank God for that, my son Jesus Christ. Yes, today we're going to South Africa. <laughs> I know people don't know Prophet TB Joshua's son. One of his son is Poon Yani in South Africa. Whatever that is troubling your life, I command it to go. Come out of them. Leave their body. 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 Son of David, have mercy on me, Lord. Open your lips and begin to ask for his mercy. Spirit of disobedience, be broken. Spirit of unfaithfulness, be broken. Spirit of hatred, be broken. Be broken. I say the best prayer is praying against our weaknesses. My brother, be careful of women. Are you listening? Yes. You pray against women. Yes. Are you listening? Yes. Mm, women, uh, they've tempered with your destiny. So I just have to look at, do you see how the spirit of God is working? So I'm looking at your vomit, I will look at you and uh, the Lord will carry me to know what you are vomiting there. It's true. Well, I'm currently in a divorce because of fighting, because of being busy with all the extramarital activities, not paying Love attention for Jesus. to her. <laughs> <laughs> me being busy with what? With what? And God is using him amazingly there. People of South Africa, yes, support him too, because he's one of TB Joshua's children. Simple gospel, very deep with demonstration. But here, after preaching there, praying for people there, you are of fire, all of us fire. Ah, it is. Now I can't see because it's an audio cassette. I say, yeah, 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 yeah. who's this man? <laughs> he just say, Holy Ghost fire. People are saying, I'm a banjo, I'm a banjo, I'm a witch. Now, I wanted to see this man in action. And then the man arranged for a video cassette. Now I see serious healings. And I asked myself, I've been to churches. And all these things, we don't see them. Not on TV, not anywhere. We just see even the church I visited, we don't see this. Now this man is doing the very same things. And I said, this is the man that I long to see one day. The things that I love about Poon Nyani is his sermons. Some we have absolutely nothing. Because if you obey some of God's commandments, God will give you some of his blessings. You obey all of God's commandments. God give you all of his God's blessing. So who's robbing who here? God is faithful to his faithful followers. Obeying God always seems difficult, all of us, until you realize that what he's asking you to do, it is for your own good. Don't drink, don't smoke. When you go to hospital, you will find people there that they are busy trying to fix the liver because of too much drinking. The liver is damaged. The lungs are damaged. Smoking for many years. Obeying God, don't do this, don't do that. Seems difficult, but by the time you realize that it's, it is for your own health, you now see that ah, it is for my own good. I'm not doing it for God. It's actually God helping me for, for me. He's helping me for me. He, he almost remind me of our prophet, T.B. Joshua. He is our prophet's son. I know him. He has been to Squan so many times. And he even talked about himself uh, going to T.B. Joshua. So if you have the time, you can watch it on his channel. Great relationship. Monday morning, Monday start a new week, a new day. I'm tired. In the afternoon, I remember that I had a dream. The prophet was not able to Let me call him. Take my phone. Hello? Hello, hello. This is uh, Pastor David Ponyani. May I please speak to David? Okay. Hold on, sir. Ah, David! The reason why you are calling me because you dream me. <laughs> 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 
just like that. The reason why you're calling me is because you dream about me. Huh? Yes, sir. <laughs> Do you want to dream me before you call me? So, oh, Jesus. I love the way he teaches about forgiveness and so on and so forth. And I love the way he reacts with the people and the, the deliverances, the miracles that happens there. It's amazing. In the mighty name of Jesus, you deceiving spirit, your time has expired. Okay. Fire in the name of Jesus Christ. Fire in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Out of him. Come out of him. Come out. Come out of him. Leave him. Come out of him. In the name of Jesus. Jesus wants you out of this body. Come out of him. In the name of Jesus. Come out. Out. You giant man. In the name of Jesus. Le guy. Huh? Pastor. Le guy in that day. What is le guy in that? You wanna we go all the way to Eh, hey, what else is it? What 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 is it? is What you said. That spirit that has been making you to not to be running again, to be sick, Jesus has cast it out. Oh. You are free in Jesus' name. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. I'm free. So, South Africa, you have someone. Watch him and you'll find out for yourself. So, they said something interesting happened in this video. One day when he was preaching. Let's go watch it. During the healing and fruit of the womb service of the Roadmap Ministry, as Apostle David Bonyani was sharing the word of God, something strange happened. What is the greatest achievement on earth? Can anybody answer that? The greatest achievement on earth ne, is to live righteous and to glorify God, to, pre to pre prepare us where we are going. Where we are going. Okay. Thank you, Daddy. Hey, my people, did you see what happened there? Did you see the angel behind the guy? Watch it again. Watch it with me. The greatest achievement on earth. Can anybody answer that? The greatest achievement on earth ne, is to live righteous and to glorify God, to, pray, to pre prepare us where we are going. Where we are going. Okay. Thank you, Daddy. In great awe, on the 7th of December of 2022, Trevor Hardy from USA sent an email to the Roadmap Ministry concerning what he had seen. Um, and his email reads as thus. My name is Trevor Marquez Hardy Sr. and I am from the United States and I am 20 years old. And in this video, I saw a white figure that seems to be an angel. I was so amazed as I was watching the video. I had just seen the this white figure walking behind Baba as he gave an answer to what the man of God had asked. God bless you so much. Do pay close attention behind the man. A beam can be seen passing. With the assistance of technology, the brightness of the footage was extensively decreased. Even so, we can still see the being moving. The greatest achievement. My people, did you see that? My people, did you see that? I saw it. That's amazing. You see, I would say maybe it's Prophet TV Joshua's <laughs> angel. <laughs> but I don't know. He's an angel of God. He's with all Prophet TV Joshua's children everywhere. That's amazing. We can know that God, our God that we serve, is a mighty, mysterious God. People, trust God, believe Him. Where the Spirit of the Lord is, there is freedom, there is liberty. And you can see that place, He's right there. <laughs> it's amazing and I love it. Where the Spirit of God is, you can see it for yourself now. On earth, ne, is to live righteous and to glorify God, to, pray, to pre prepare us where we are going. Where we are going. Okay. Thank you, Daddy. What then shall we say wow. about this? Glory be to God.
Roadmap Ministry. If you need deliverance or prayer, pray with Roadmap Ministry. There is a mighty, mighty hand of God upon that church. Support him, you know, watch it, and you will see how God is delivering people from there. If you're waiting for deliverance and you are in South Africa, you can go there for your deliverance and you'll be free from whatever burdens you have and glorify God. Just a short video, but it's amazing because I love when God, <laughs> God manifests himself like that in a place. It has happened so many times in Squan, and not only Squan, Daniel's place, John Chi's place, Christopher's place, Harry's place, it has, you know. So you can see how the hand of God is upon these churches, okay? Worship with them. Go there if you need deliverance. I mean, we are all one body. We are all one body under one God. So therefore, there is no division whereby T.B. Joshua's churches are concerned. We are all together. Worship with them. Okay, love you, love you, love you. Have a wonderful, blessed weekend, blessed week, blessed day. May the Lord be with you all as we always worship Him in our hearts. Thank you for watching this with me. God bless you, Emma from Tema.